my friends, my family. How are you guys this morning? Um, this morning we're going to do another Let's Talk About It. Um, it's so very bright already this morning. Um, you guys are probably look a little different because, well, a little shorter. Um, anyway, I'm on my way to the, um, to Walmart to get an oil change in my car. Um, the car that my son had been driving and, you know, he kind of screwed it up a little bit with the tire and stuff. Um, I got um, a new tire and everything. Um, I did not have to get a new rim, um, which I don't even care about because these rims, I'm ready for them to get gone up out of here. Um, I ain't really got the time. And I kind of told myself I wanted to get rid of the car anyway um, because I have the car, I have the truck. But, you know, I'm like, I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure because anything can happen to one vehicle and I, I've definitely been in situations where I needed a, a backup vehicle. So, um, in, anyhow, while we're on the way to Walmart, um, okay, the, let's talk about it subject. Um, that um, we're going to be talking about today. And I just want to shoot something in here right quick. Um, if you're new to my channel, please make sure you like and you subscribe um, and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified every time I upload a brand new video. So with that being said, um, the question I have is, um, have you ever been in a situation where someone brushed you off and how did you handle it when you were brushed off um, by the person um, I'm gonna say I've been in situations to where I've been brushed off um, by someone um, not the same person every time but I've, I've definitely um, been in a situation to where um, I was brushed off, you know what I mean? And um, I think it's very rude. Um, I think it's very rude. I'm sorry, this big old truck was in the way. I didn't know where he was going and what he was doing. Um, but yeah, I think it's very, very rude to brush somebody off. Um, I feel like um, if someone calls you, right, um, don't be so quick to brush that person off. Because A, you don't know what the person is calling you for. You don't know what it is that the person needs to talk to you about. Um, it definitely can be something very, very, very serious. You don't even know that because you didn't take the time to listen to the person. Um, I think one of the rudest things ever is um, for if a person calls you, you, oh, I'm busy, I'm doing this, I'm doing that, and the third, you know, I, I don't have time to um, talk to you on the phone. Or if a person says, oh, I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta get off the phone right now. I'll, I'll call you back. Right? And you, you haven't even been on the phone long. Right? Um, you just never, never know. And I guess because I am a person who I have a lot of empathy. I have a lot of sympathy. Um, you know, I, I will tell you. <coughs> I've been in situations sometimes where um, I got exhausted by people calling me, you know, sometimes. And I just felt like, okay, I need a break. I don't really want to talk to this person. Just because I'm mentally tired, mentally ex ex exhausted, you know. But um, it's very hard for me not to answer the phone somebody's call. It's very hard because I always think about what could be happening. What could be going on? Is this an emergency? Um, it's very hard for me um, to just dismiss a phone call right off the back. 
that's very um because i feel like people you know they they need to talk and i need to be able to give them that respect um that they need and it's a lot of times that i've been on the listening end that's another thing people don't know how or want to listen to others but people want you to listen to them all the time all the time you know it's, it's okay for you to listen to them all the time but they don't want to re rescind you know what i mean by listening to you some of the time so that's that's a big big point right there because um and like i said the these are situations I've been in and I'm just wondering, you know, please leave it in the comments below if you have experienced these same situations. Um, you know, <laughs> because it's just very, um, and <clears throat> I tend to handle a brush off, um, as in you you don't want to talk to me and I handle it as okay that's fine I'm gonna give you your space that's how I handle um, being brushed off um, I'm gonna give you your space because evidently you know you don't have um, the time right and um, for me okay that's okay that's that's cool but keep in mind you know when a person then decides, okay, oh, they want to reach out to me and they want me to extend the listening ear. Do you really want me to have time? Should I have time? No. <laughs> I, I, I shouldn't have time. I mean, I'm busy too. I'm, I'm busy too. Um... I'm, I'm now raising three children in my home because my two oldest are gone. Um, I work a full-time um, job. Even though I'm self-employed, I still work full-time hours. Um, sometimes more than full-time hours. Um, so, I everybody is busy. Everybody is busy. But just don't be so selfish to feel like, oh, it's all about me. It's all about me, and it's never about the next person. I ain't got time for the next person. I just got time for me. I only got time for the problems that's going on in my life. I ain't got time for um, nobody else. It's okay for me to call somebody else and tell them about all my problems in America, but it's not okay for the next person to call me about their problems or just because they might want to talk about something. You know what I mean? It's and that's not okay that's selfish so anyhow folks um that's my topic of the day um that i just wanted to touch base on and um you know i i have no problem getting things saying things to people um and just you know moving on or whatever so anyhow um please let me know guys if you like my um let's talk about it um subjects and if you would want me to continue to do more of let's talk about it um please let me know and um i'll see what i can do i hope i haven't been this hasn't been crooked the whole time i'm sorry guys but yeah just um let me know um if you want me to do a little bit more segments um videos and um because i realize i have so much to talk about um and um is this thing is stuck and yeah yeah i i realize um there's so many topics to talk about not all the topics are mine or have to do with me personally um some of the topics are just um random topics random things that's going on in the world so i didn't want to make this video um let's talk about it too long um i'm gonna go ahead and sign off get on about it here and uh, maybe do a little bit of recording while i'm in 
Wally World, aka Walmart. Um, I hope everybody is having a blessed morning and I hope everybody has a great day. Um, always remember to smile. Um, just that's very important. Always smile and everything. So here we go. Going up to this Walmart auto place. And um, let's see what's going to be going on here. Pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Oh, I like singing. Oh, look. Oh, girl, it's only one car here. Where should I pull up at? Okay, guys. All right, you know what time it is. It's Rita Bonita. Love you guys, and I'm out. Bye.